I hope you're down there paying for all of the things that you did to me. I hope you're burning in hell. Yeah, you know, one can't just get a bullet in his head and get free. There'll be no peace. For your whole family, as long as I'm alive. I'll make your son pay for all the sins that you committed. Oh, all of them. And I won't rest until I've made him pay, Papa. Hello, and how are you doing, Kareem? What do you want now? I paid my debt. That may be, but it's not over just because you paid your debt. Just what are you saying? This is what I'm saying to you, Kareem. You and I are buddies now. All your schemes and your plans with your girlfriend, I know about them. Look. This is your happiest moment. If your rich wife knows what a turd you are before she becomes your wife, the wedding will be called off. Isn't that so? Look, stop being such an asshole. Just get off my back. Don't you talk to me as if I were trash. You'd better watch your mouth. What do you want? Huh? That's more like it. Now let us talk nicely. I have a very simple request. I want to be near my brother on his happiest day. I want to be your best man and stand by you at your wedding. What? I want to be your best man. <laughs> have you gone mad or what? What is it you're planning now? Listen to me, Kareem. If you want this wedding to take place, you'll do as I say. We're not friends anymore. We're foes. You got it? As witnesses, you've heard them both. They've taken each other as husband and wife. Do you bear witness to this? I do. I do. Here you are. I now pronounce you husband and wife with the power given to me by the high municipality. Congratulations. Well then, what a happy moment. What are you doing here? Uh, it doesn't have to be over because the debt's paid, Anna. Has the debt been paid? Ah, so you don't know, do you? Your boyfriend didn't tell you so you wouldn't stop the wedding, huh? <laughs>